Michelle and Damien stop the train. It's coming. Michelle and Damien stop the train. Top the top big train. Michelle and Damien stop the train. It's coming. Michelle and Damien stop the train. Top the top big train. I might just fade it out. Hey, Easter yeah. is coming up soon, guys. Easter? It's already yep. Easter. Can you believe it? I saw, you know, all the Easter eggs about six months ago. I know. I saw them just, going, just before Christmas. Yes, that's right. <laughs> it tells You're me like, those kids are going to be home again. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, school holidays again. Holidays won't be too oh. far away. Uh, well, Cadbury's have now released a 125-gram caramel Easter bunny. Ooh, nice. Everybody's into the caramel. Uh, that'll happen for the very first time ever. So they're dropping them at supermarkets very soon. Want to know? Topic train. What's your go-to chocolate, Damo? You got a bit of a sweet tooth. What's your go-to chocky? Oh, Chiquito, you will never know. Oh, really? Chiquito? I love a Chiquito. Wow. If you put a Chiquito into the fridge, you get it nice and cold. What you can do then, in the same way that you could do it with a flake, you take it out of the fridge... All the chocolate breaks off into big bits. You put it into a glass of milk uh, with the caramel as well in there. And then you get a little spoon and you feed it to yourself. And it is delicious. Uh, Michelle? So random, Yeah, man. you're not wrong. So random, but yeah, uh, until you've tried it, don't knock it. What's your go-to well, chocolate for you, didn't knock you it, Michelle? I don't really have one, I have to say. No, no uh, chocolate. No. No. no um, I, I like a good crunchy. And that's gone in through the family now because my son Finnegan, he loves a crunchy. I don't know. I'm, all, I'm, I'm and... always disappointed with a crunchy. Why? I just, it's just, I'm just disappointed with it. I always think I'm going to get more out of it. And there's then, the soft bit and the hard bit. And, oh, man, that just, is... There's not enough chocolate on, on a crunchy for me. Mm. I'm just I'm disappointed. To you too. Mm, my exactly. God. Yeah. Something has happened to me. I, I, as I've gotten older... I'm just off it. And my son oh. said the funniest thing to me. I'm all, uh, it, it, Recently, this uh, a friend of mine, a male friend who sometimes visits me, uh, oh. brings me snacks. And Ooh. my son, Louis, made an observation because we jumped in the car the other day and, and he noticed, he opened the glove box and there was a packet of um, snakes, yep. lollies in there, unopened. And he oh. goes, there's snakes in here. And I went, oh, God, yes. Oh, <laughs> I just remembered... I said, when we went for a drive, a road trip recently, this friend of mine put them in there, and I just forgot all about them. He goes, oh, my uh, God. He goes, he always brings you snacks, and you never open them. Oh. And he must always think, when is she opening the snacks? <laughs> but you never, he goes, but then you never open the snacks, and you just keep talking. Uh, Isn't that oh, fascinating? Wow. wow. He brought up two things there, yeah. the talk and Indeed. Annie also. Yeah. You're, you're that person. Don't you, hit, don't you hit that friend of yours? Yes. That, That's right. That you bring yep. over, even when you visit them, you bring over, say, you know, really nice cupcakes or something like that, you and they we, don't open them? You know that this you're is like, a radio segment here, Damo. I've got another topic for you. Oh, oh there's another one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Nicholas geez. Cage has just gotten married for the fifth time. Now, want to know, oh, on the topic train... Does this sort of thing happen in real life or is this just showbiz land? Have you guys got a friend who's been married multiple times? Do you know anybody married multiple times? Not five times. No way. Five times. Okay, ridiculous. I, I, Nicholas Cage. Maximum two. I know someone who's yeah. been married twice. But, but once you get into three, you're a Hollywood person. That's How's it. this? I know a lady who was married, got divorced from the first husband, married the second husband, they had a great time, loved one another, got divorced... And then went, ah, we're around each other so much. Let's just get married again. The same married person. Married the, the same second? person. Married the same person this, the third time. I love that. I, I love know, that. It's great, so they married it? the second husband again. Yes. So I married twice that. to the same person. But they got divorced yeah, in that. between. Yeah, they got divorced. So they, they, they fell in love. They married. They, they fell out of love. They got yep. divorced. Couldn't be apart. Got married again. Love that. See, doesn't just happen they, in Hollywood. They land. need to make up their mind. That's that's actually <laughs> yeah. what's going on. They're both a bit they, confused. They need to just sit down and just take a long, hard look at themselves. Yeah, yeah. You know? I think most people though too. But if you're any more than about three, you're in Hollywood territory. He's just getting extravagant then. Exactly. Just-